pretty smooth work. I set them up, you knock them down. What? Robin, I got her back for you. I juiced her up. How did you know we're back together? Free cable is the ultimate aphrodisiac, Steven. I don't want you messing around with my life. I know. I felt bad about the other night. I wanted to make it up to you. So what are you doing? You want to catch a flick? Look, I appreciate you helping me out with Robin. But you have to understand, I'm going to have to work extra hard to not screw this relationship up again. You're a very nice guy, but I just don't have any room in my life for a new friend. Okay? So, what are you trying to say? I don't want to be your friend. I appreciate your honesty. You're a real straight shooter. So you're all right. Hey. I'm a big boy. It's no big deal. Whatever. You're sure? Uh-huh. I'm fine. Robin Harris. Hey, it's Chip Douglas. Chip Douglas. The cable guy. Oh. Hi. What's up? I feel kind of weird calling you. It's just, uh, I'm worried about Steven. What is it? Well, something isn't right. Uh, doesn't seem like himself lately. Have you noticed anything, or, uh... No, actually, things are going really well. Good. That makes me feel better. Well, should I be worried? Nope. I'm probably just being a nervous Nelly. <laughs> Let's just keep our eyes open. All right. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye. All right, I just want to put this out there. Stevie, you did it, man. You took your cojones and mine and you put them on the table and you slam dunked it. <laughs> Way to go. Now watch, they're probably gonna give him my job. <laughs> anyway, on, on to the next order of business. Steven. We just closed escrow in the downtown plot. So now that we have that bear off our back, we can get down to the order of finding an architect. Now, corporate sent me a list of names. I don't really know but anyway. There are Steven Kovacs in here. Uh, yeah, I'm Steven Kovacs. What's the problem? You're under arrest, son. What did he do? Receipt of stolen property. What? What? I don't know anything about it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I oh, cannot oh, speak until spoken to. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say may be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Do you understand? But I didn't accept any stolen goods. Deluxe karaoke machine. She, she. Big screen she. TV, TV. Cream in his cream in his cream in his pain. And, and. I can't believe you did this. I didn't do anything. He gave you a big screen TV and a hi-fi system as a present? You expect me to believe that? You know you're killing your mother with this. I swear it's true. Why would you accept such extravagant gifts? I don't know. I shouldn't have. What's really going on here, Stephen? Are you on something? Are you taking the pot? I'm fine. I didn't do anything. Just call my cable guy. Stephen, the police looked into it. Nobody named Chip Douglas works for the cable company. This is a mistake. This can't be happening. Yes, it is, and it's killing your mother. When can you get me out of here? Well, unfortunately, there's no time to get a bail hearing today. You're gonna have to spend the weekend in county lockup. No me! Look at a pretty boy! Shut up! Let me! Nobody touches me! I'm gonna that booty, you see? I'm gonna introduce myself, homeboy, and they call me the pumper. And I'll be your friend. Lockdown!
hear anything? Hello, Stephen. I came as soon as I could. What's your real name? It's Larry Tate, but that's not what's important right now. We have to get you out of here. I was watching court TV. I think I found a loophole in your case. I'm going to talk to the judge about a writ of habeas corpus. I'll put the system on trial. Why are you doing this to me? I didn't do this to you. You did this to you. You set me up. No, I taught you a lesson. I can be your best friend or your worst enemy. You seem to prefer the latter. I'm just here to comfort you. Come on, touch it. Huh? Come on, you need human contact. Touch it. I will not touch it. What are you doing? Stop it. Stop it. I know how you're feeling right now. Stop it, stop it. Don't do that. I'm here for you. Uh. Don't do that, Jesus Christ. You're going to get me killed. <laughs> Out of here. <laughs> Oh, Billy. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. <laughs> Remember Midnight Express? Oliver Stone won the Academy Award for Best Screenplay. Awesome, awesome scene. Guard, this is the man who framed me. He's right here. He set me up. Arrest him. Hey, Bernie, how's that sports package? All right. By the way, don't worry about Robin. I'll make sure she's well taken care of. If you go near her, I'll kill you. That's it. Come on, let's go. This concludes our broadcast day. You bet your ass you've been blowing me off. Wow, well, this guy's really been doing a number on me. I told you not to hang out with him. You told me to offer him money and get free cable. Did I tell you to have a karaoke jam with him? Goldman. Got it. Rick, I'm out on bail. OK, I'll see if I can get my friend in research to track him down. What'd you say his name was? Well, he calls himself Larry Tate, but he told me his name is Chip Douglas. Chip Douglas, Chip Douglas. Why does that sound so familiar? Are you OK? Yeah, I'm fine. You're not fine. When you say you're fine, I know that you're not fine. I just want to get this over with. I hate visiting my parents. Is this guy cool? <laughs> joking. Come on in, you psycho. What is he doing here? Invited him. You invited him when? At lunch the other day. At lunch the other day? You had lunch with him? You look great. <laughs> and you are a vision. Hello, Stephen. You look rested. Come here. What's wrong, Stephen? I'm sensing some weird energy from you. Yeah, well, maybe that's because I just got out of jail where you sent me. I should just take you to the police right now. You can if you like. But I'd hate to have to show Robin this. Bastard! 